right, so here he is, one of the consensus greatest of all time, the newly minted UFC heavyweight champion, John Bones Jones. And I think by and large, this sport is better when he is in it. Tonight, he tries to successfully defend his UFC heavyweight title. Yeah, John Jones at heavyweight is something that we have waited for for a really long time. And to say that he delivered would be a massive understatement as he won the fight in the way that he did. John Jones, once again, building on such a strong legacy. You guys relish fight night as much as John Jones. You see him grinning ear to ear as soon as he hits the tunnel. We'll see how it goes in title defense number one. Right. John Jones, one of the greatest of all time, set to fight Max West Hollywood. the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> your referee, he's the third man in the octagon tonight. All right, we are ready to go here at the start of round one for this stand-up only event. So grapplers need not apply. We outline the rules off the top, but here's your refresher. No grappling of any type. We also point out fighters cannot do follow-up strikes on the ground. Let's see if the combatants play by the rules here as our first round gets underway. All right, here we go. First round is underway. No denying the big reach advantage for him tonight. We'll see if he can get that jab going. Look for him to circle on the outside. Use that long jab to keep his distance and only engage on his terms. All right, no surprise to see Johnny Bones Jones open with some of those long-range weapons and finding some early success in this one. That's exactly what he does. He throws the front kick to the leg, and he throws those lead kicks to the body. He's long, he's 6'4 for the weight class, and he has learned masterfully how to fight with his height and his range. All those long range weapons are John Jones' call the card. Oh, big elbow. All right, so one minute into the fight, and I'm not sure these fighters realize that we got three or five rounds tonight. No feeling out process at all. The moment this fight started, these two gentlemen were ready to knock each other's heads off. Jones is circling towards the left side now. Good sequence there. The right hand followed by the left. Big shot to the head. More strikes to the head. Well, missed on that one. Just over three minutes to go now. Patented front kick there by Holloway. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Just missed on that spinning attack. Oh, big Superman punch there. Oh, oh he's hurt bad. Over 20 total strikes have landed for Max West Hollywood. Holloway gets caught by that straight hand. Don't wait, you hit him first. 
Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Oh, left hook. start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You got to think he's going to continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Well, well guys, his on. opponent has not done anything to deter him. He should keep doing this, keep going to the well until his opponent finds an answer because right now he seems lost to it. All right, late round action here, and we know John Jones is a five tool player. Back to the feet now. Big, straight left. All right, so an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has recovered. His opponent's recovered. Now he's got to deal with everything. He should have got the fight finished at that time. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. That one connected. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. Nice front kick there. He missed with that jab attempt there. Well, that calf is starting to show signs of bruising now. And you can tell in the way that he's walking. It's starting to take an effect. Well, fortunate that one didn't land to the head. The hook shot blocked by Jones. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of throws. Round two coming up next. All right, there's the horn. What a round it was, DC. And of course, the seminal moment, that big knockdown that nearly got his opponent out of there for good. Almost finished the fight, but now he needs to reset, right? Don't rush. Go right. back out to the next round and just try to find that shot again. If he rushes, if he overexerts himself, he will run out of energy and put himself at risk of losing the fight. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. And what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body. He throws them low. But when he goes up top, he's very powerful. And he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight. But he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Second round here. Holloway strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, beautifully placed shot to the leg. Oh, Superman punch. Oh, huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Keep that head moving. Head movement. Oh. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Unable to connect there. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Uh, judges handle like that uppercut. Those are big strikes. All right, so able to get the hands going once again. He lands another punch. Nice work on the feet by Holloway. He's got to be careful. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Holloway gets caught by the inside leg kick. 
man, that is loud. Another strike lands for the kickboxer. He really found that low state pretty early in this fight, and he hasn't looked back. He found it really early. And when this guy gets into his groove, he is hell on wheels. And right now he is showing why he is such a high-level, high-regarded kickboxer. He is outclassing this guy. Just out of the range with that right hand. Jones is bleeding from the mouth. Daniel looks as though there's a cut on his lip. Thankfully, he's a lot tougher than I am. Oh, went for the spinning kick there. Telegraphed it a little bit. No good. So the numbers continue to pile up. 71 total strikes have landed for Max Holloway. Well, not this fighter's most accurate effort to date necessarily, DC. Landing with 33% accuracy here against John Jones. Let's open up that top now. Two minutes to go. Holloway's hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that stand as his chin been tested early. All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut, and man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flowing. Yeah, as it should be. Right? He should be focused on getting to that cut. Making his opponent pay. He did the work. He opened up the cut. Now it's on him to continue on the path and make the ringside position come here and try to stop this fight. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble chin. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Under a minute now to go. Outstanding the body there. He's the taller fighter. Might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so there. Oh, nice. Nice. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Hands higher, hands higher. Rips the body there for good measure. All right, so a wise decision by him to continue to attack that cut, and it's getting wider by the minute. It's getting wider by the minute. This guy is, is, is a fantastic fighter, and he's as smart as they come. So the moment that cut opened up, you knew that that would become his focus, and we are seeing it very clear right now. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, so back to the stools we go. They say defense wins championships, and he has not defended well tonight. He isn't trying, or at least it doesn't seem like he's trying. He has got to move his head. He's trying to react when the punch is already coming, and that's not working. If he takes many more of these shots, this fight is going to be stopped due to the swell. Ready to fight. Ready. Third round underway. All right, next round is now underway. Do you see any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the outfit. Even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high levels of martial arts. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Nice jab there by Holloway. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. So the unofficial numbers, 104. Total strikes have landed for Max Blessed Holloway. Well, not the most efficient ever. He's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Nice leg kick. Oh, hook to 
to the head by Jones. Every time he throws that leg kick, he lands with so much force. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. Man, it doesn't take much for the redness to fall. Oh, oh, he is stunned. Drunk driving out there. We'll see if he can recover. Oh, spinning back fist. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Jones's nose is bleeding now. Looks to be cut, perhaps there on the bridge. Three minutes now to go on the round. Go after the cut. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, you went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other. Oh, big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fit. So the blood really starting to flow. Every time that area gets targeted, that cut's getting worse. It's getting worse and worse. And you see the blood starting to come down. That is when you start to watch the fighter to see what type of effect it's starting to take on him, whether or not he's reaching forward, whether or not he's confused by where it's at. You gotta start to watch his reactions now as we go forward. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Well, he continues to manage distance beautifully and take advantage of that edge and reach. Just out of range with that right hook. Holloway's doing a nice job there. You saw him raise the guard to block that offering from the opponent. Don't want to sustain it. Yeah, huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get in this place so that he doesn't get finished. Oh, and it lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter in this instance. In this well, perhaps it's a high fight IQ, perhaps it's obvious, but he is attacking that cut that is getting deeper by the minute. And it seems like the right decision because you can see his opponent starting to paw at it. You can see oh! oh, he gets up here, but he is on wobbly legs. Big right here. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's going kick after kick after kick. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Oh, you've got to like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Got to be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you got to like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Final seconds here. Perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, so a big round for him there, maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there, courtesy of the kick. DC, talk us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. You ready to fight? Ready. Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner should maximize those 60 seconds on the screen. This is what happens when you get two very skilled, very evenly matched fighters 
coming together. Nobody has really taken That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Both tough, both durable, both unwilling to take a step back. What a phenomenal fight. Well, let's see if he goes to set up the hook again. He has really done a nice job punctuating his combinations with that hook tonight. Oh, unable to find the target with that hook shot. Holloway's really targeting that cut right now, and why not? He has opened up his opponent. Might as well continue to attack that particular area. Slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a point. And the oh. He's got him right here. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Holloway whiffs on the left there. Holloway's eye is closing up now. Not good for him. Watch these to the body. Well, he landed a big knockout in the previous round, and you can just tell his confidence is growing from here. His confidence is through the roof, as it should be. He's doing a great job right now of landing strikes. He just now has to find the one that's going to end the night. It got checked. Jones is really having a hard time putting weight on that leg now. You can see the obvious limp, and a lot of that is due to the leg kicks courtesy of his opponent. Oh, he lands another huge leg kick downstairs. Oh, that mercy, man. This could be the beginning of the game. John, it's time for his corner to start looking at stopping this fight. He has taken far too many of these leg kicks. Under 90 seconds to go. Oh, that's a good strike there by Max Bless Holloway. Well, that is a shade of magenta on his calf. I'm not sure I've seen before. That bruising's getting out of control. The bruising's getting bad. And it's starting to get to a point where you got to keep an eye on whether or not this guy will be able to finish the fight. Tries the flying knee to no avail. One minute to go in the round. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to hit too many more of those. Oh, he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Holloway's an absolute mess right now. There's blood everywhere. I'm not so sure they're not going to stop this fight right now. Uh, back and forth we go. Oh! Tried to land the punch, but a swing and a miss by Jones. Right on the ball. Oh! Need some work, guys. Nice jab. That gets stopped by leg kicks. I'm a verbal attack. Yeah. All right, there's the end of the round, and hopefully not the end of the fight. He doesn't look as handsome as he did when he walked out. That is a severe gash on his face.
You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth ready. and final round. Oh! He's got to keep pressing here. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. The body shot there. Holloway's limping now, Daniel. You see the right leg damage, a lot of it courtesy of that last kick. So we'll see if he can figure out a way to get his footwork back and make the requisite adjustments. Nice kick, yo. But he needs to check one of these. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Jones. Well, this UFC fight is sort of dissolving into a horror movie. I don't need to see any more damage inflicted. You don't have to lose everything on one night. His corner can stop the fight now, and he would be mad now, but he would appreciate them later because it will extend his career going down the line. Oh, and he plants another leg kick. Man, his opponent's on the Uncle, uncle, uncle. If I, hey, it's like Rocky. I'm on the apron with the white cow. Throw it in, boy. Oh, it's over. Oh, landed some big shots, too. He's got to find a way to finish this fight. Oh, nice jab. Oh, again. Well, we talked about that reach advantage. He's in a lot of trouble now. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Attack that cut for me. Let's go. Just out of range with that strike. Oh, knee strike right to the body. Yet another big knee. Nice jab by Holloway, yes. Oh, good head movement there. Nice flip. Oh, that'll do it! John Jones with a huge knockout tonight. <laughs> oh, man. Let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Bruce Buffer inside the octagon with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 55 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, John Bones Jones! All right, what a knockout for John Jones. Perhaps a bonus winning effort for him here tonight. Competitive matchup, at least on paper, but...